Hello students, now we're going to be working with the elements of poetry, which include rhyme, rhythm, and repetition. Rhyme o rima, it's when words that have the same ending sound. Es cuando las palabras tienen el mismo sonido al final. These words are usually found at the end of a line. Estas palabras generalmente se encuentran al final de cada línea de un poema. Here we have an example. Aquí tenemos un ejemplo donde yo les marqué ya todas las palabras que tienen rima. Here we have another example that we already saw in the previous video where all the corresponding words are highlighted. Aquí les marqué todas las palabras que riman con el mismo color. En este otro ejemplo, que es una canción de cuna que todos conocemos, les subrayé o les marqué todas las palabras que riman. Como bien notaron, todas estas palabras están al final de cada línea. Rhythm o ritmo is the beat of the poem heard in the pattern of the stressed and unstressed syllables. El ritmo de un poema es como el ritmo de una canción. En este ejemplo del poema We Real Cool, escrito por Gwendolyn Brooks, yo utilizo las pausas que me ponen en el poema para hacer una canción. Y empiezo a hacer snaps mientras lo leo. It could go a little bit like this. We real cool, we left school, we lurk late, we strike straight, we sing sin, we thin gin, we just tune, we die soon. Cada poema puede tener un ritmo diferente. En este otro poema, el ritmo, tú lo puedes conseguir si rapeas el poema. If I was going to rap this poem, I would do it like this. There's a polar bear in a frigid air. He likes it because it's cold in there with the seed and the meat and his face and his fish and his big hairy paws and a buttery dish. Por último, tenemos lo que es repetición. Lastly, we have repetition. In a poem, you can repeat words, phrases, or lines And this is usually to show importance. Langston Hughes uses repetition in his poem I Too. Le subrayé a ustedes la frase que él está repitiendo. Why do you think he does this? Here we have another example of repetition. You can see the words that are repeated. Why do you think these words are repeated? What does the poet want to say? In this last example, we can clearly see repetition. The poet repeats, I'm carsick, over and over again. And the line that is in between is somebody else's response. So in this poem, why do you think repetition is done?